Hello lovely people, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So guys, I invested in a cheap juicer in Nigeria. So this is me trying it out for the first time to make you see how it works and if I'm going to be recommending it or not. So sit back and enjoy this juicy content. <laughs> So guys, these are the fruits I'll be using. I'll be using oranges. I've peeled the oranges and all some pineapples and I have some cucumbers right there as well. So that's what I'll be using to make this juice, okay? And I'll be using my hand. I'm not wearing gloves. My hands are clean, okay? <laughs> so that's the juicer right there. And that's me trying to make the juice. I'll let you listen to a clip shortly. Did you hear that, guys? Part of the things they wrote on the box was that he's, go he's not going to be shouting like a silent juicer. Omo, this one is shouting like a generator. <laughs> it's too loud. Like, that's one downside to it. They promised that he's going to be silent juicer, but this thing is shouting like a tiger generator. So that's one downside to it. Yeah. Other than that, it's quite okay for a cheap juicer. I got it for 9,000 Naira. How much is that in dollar? I'm going to insert that in dollar. 9,000 Naira is very, very cheap to get a juicer that works like this. Okay, so so this is me trying to like bring out the juice I got from those cucumber. Yeah, I'm trying to dissemble it. Look at the juice. Looks so good. Like, even though I don't eat cucumber and I will never drink this juice, I'm making this for my husband and my mom. It looks it looks good it looks good actually and pardon me i don't have the glass all those fancy stuff for juicing i'll get those later another downside to this juicer is what i'm about to show you guys now this juicer is not doing justice to the pulp at all look how wet the pulp is like i had to pour the pulp into a sieve you know to extract more juice from it if not if i say i should throw that away i'll be wasting like a lot of juice I'll be wasting a lot of juice. So that's another downside. I used to see like big, big juicers that would like pulp it out so dry. But this is not doing, it's not doing that. The pulp is too wet. You have to go an extra mile of like squeezing it out. Okay. So this is me making the orange juice. I just wanted to show you again how it works. Yeah. Basically, you put it in that hole and then you press it down with that green thing. Then the juice comes on one side, the pulp goes on the other side, like so. Yeah. Also, I don't know if you notice me using my finger to press down that green thing, that like clip on the side. That clip keeps like disengaging or losing contact. And once that clip loses contact, the juicer stops working. So I have to like press it down with my hand. Like I even thought the thing got spoiled at some point because it stopped working. And then we had to, I just figured it out that whenever I press it, it starts working again. So that's why I'm pressing it with my fingers. And it's not really, it's not really nice that way. But I don't think it's the problem of the products. I think maybe this particular one, maybe it dropped in the hand of the sellers or something. And that thing is not like making, um, it's not, it's not staying put, Sha. That's just it. So I don't think it's the problem of the manufacturer. Yeah. So this is me trying to bring out the, uh, what's it called? The orange juice that I made. And yeah, again, it, it didn't do justice to the pulp. You, you're going to see the pulp later on as well. So that's the orange juice I got from the orange, <laughs> from the oranges. Okay. Yeah. So that's it. I'm just trying, I'm just admiring it. Like, I'm admiring it so much and look at the pulp like i said this pulp is too wet it's too it's too like it's too juicy to to be called a pulp yeah it's not dried enough i thought it's gonna be dry like all those big juicers but then it's a cheap one this is nine thousand era juicer i can i could see like forty thousand era juicer in the same place i bought this one i saw fifty thousand era juicer and then i went ahead to buy nine thousand era one so what do i expect <laughs> what do i expect from a nine thousand era juicer so to be honest i'm not really mad at it i'm not really mad at it so this is me making the pineapple juice yeah so i'm trying to juice the pineapple 
just trying to show you the process so overall i think this juicer is working great for that price so my people nine thousand naira for a juicer that works this fine is not bad it's not a bad price at all if i want something better i will just go for upgrade like just go for the high-end ones that will pulp it more dry you get what i'm trying to say even at, uh, as it is now my mom is trying to buy this same type of juicer even though i'm trying to convince her not to buy it i wanted her to buy the the expensive one for my own sake for my own selfish reason so that i can have access to a big juicer as well but yeah she, she she insisted that she just want to buy this one for now okay so and it, it did it did quite well to be honest i'm not really mad at this except that he's shouting like he's too noisy it's too noisy look at the pineapple juice guys so so yummy so silky so yummy and silky yeah apart from the fact that this thing is too loud and then it's not doing justice to the pulp look at me trying to pulp out to sieve out the pineapple pulp as well so those are just the two things the noise and then the uh, the pulp not being dried enough yeah and that's not it's not a big deal to be honest for the price so i keep saying for the price it's very okay for the price so am i going to recommend this yes i will recommend it if you are in a budget okay so these are the juice i was able to extract from those oranges i, I did 13 oranges yeah 13 oranges i was able to get those um juice that juice from it then the pineapple was just a piece of pineapple no a piece just one whole pineapple yeah i got that juice from that hey juice juice hey <laughs> from one pineapple okay so <laughs> and then the cucumbers i think we, we did like four cucumbers then i now realize that cucumber has a lot of water in it so guys we use only four medium-sized cucumbers to get all those juice and it is even more than this i just had to put this in the jug for the beauty of it okay you see i have remaining and eh? so guys i'm going to recommend this actually i'm going to recommend this juicer if you're on a budget but then if you can afford the iron ones it's going to be more convenient look at the pulp i got from the cucumber from the pineapple and from the oranges even though i fed it to my goats okay it didn't go to waste so guys it's gonna be the end of this video give it a thumbs up let me see your comment down below and i'm gonna catch you in my next one bye bye